got my gear on and I'm ready to play third base. <laughs> oh, Stevie, that's center field. And you don't have to wear catcher's equipment to play third base. I think it's time we learn a little bit about fielding positions. Because this position's in the middle of the infield, we'll start with the pitcher. Even in T-ball, there'll be a pitcher right here. <laughs> And the pitcher will field and try to make a play on any ball that comes into this area. I want to be pitcher. I want to be pitcher. Hold on. We still have eight more positions to go. Next is the catcher, and he protects home plate. Playing catcher is cool because he gets to wear all this great catcher's equipment. He kind of looks like a lobster. He does have a protective shell, and that's because the catcher gets balls thrown to oh. him from all different directions. He's the one that makes plays in this area. Who can tell me what base this is? That's first baseman. Correctamundo. And I bet you call the fielder there the first baseman. You are right again. Each of the bases has a fielder with the base's name on it. The first baseman covers any ball hit in this area. I bet the first baseman gets a lot of balls thrown to them. First base is usually pretty busy because every batter that hits the ball has to run to first first. They might be thrown out before going to second, third, or home, but they have to start at first. And the team on the field wants to get three out so they can have their turn to bat. Yes, they do. So each of the other infielders are thinking, when I get the ball, I'm throwing it to first. Great stop, kid. Now throw me over to first so we can get this kid out. Oh! Yeah. Who's the ball? Who's the ball? Nice try. Bye-bye. What's playing second like? Well, the second baseman plays over here, between second and first, and they cover any ball hit in this area. Whoa, that's a big area to cover. The second baseman must be really fast. They are, and on the third base side of second base is another player who is like an extra second baseman. They are called the shortstop. The shortstop not only has to be as fast as the second baseman, but he also has to be able to throw a whole lot farther. It's smart that you notice that. The throw from second is an easier and shorter toss than the one from the shortstop. These two fielders work close together. Any ball hit on the third base side of second is for the shortstop to field. The second baseman covers second. The second baseman and the shortstop also work together whenever a ball is hit to the outfield. When two or more teammates handle the ball like this, it is called a relay throw. The last infielder is the third baseman. They cover the balls hit in this area. And when a runner's on first and second, there's a force out at third. For a force out at third, the third baseman either has to catch the ball and touch third or stop the grounder, then step on third for the force out. Also remember, if there is a runner on second but not on first, there is not a force out when he runs to third. You have to tag him out with the ball in your glove. All those players make up the infield. Can we play ball now? Well, we're just about ready. But first, there are three more very important positions left. What are those, Mitt? The outfielders. Left, center, and right field. These are very important positions. Each one of these players has to field the balls in these large areas. Outfielders are some of the fastest players on the team, and they have very strong arms for throwing long distances. a lot for nothing. I was supposed to have this nice soft landing in your glove. Didn't you read the script? Hey, somebody get a stunt ball over here. I'm not doing this scene over again until somebody teaches this kid how to catch a good. How many of about to get the glove and then you read the script? And catching fly balls are fun, too. It can be fun catching fly balls, but until you learn, you should always use a softer ball, like the tennis and wiffle ball we played catch with earlier. Once you've got the hang of it, then we can use BB's friend's real baseball. Catch me, catch me, catch me! You, I like it. Lots of balls are going to want to be caught by you. See ya! Always remember, every position on the field is very important. It takes each and every player doing their best to make a great team. Both infielders and outfielders need to be very good at their position in order for the team to do well. And as good sports, you should always support your teammates with compliments and cheers every time they make a great play.